Okay, hopefully this is clear enough. I'm just gonna clean up some cast iron and do a, a quick video on how to season or how I season. So I'm just gonna get these rinsed off. This is an old, quite old griddle. Unmarked, don't know who made it. I have no idea. Notice I'm using stainless steel, not copper. I'm not using anything that's transfer. Probably edit some of this out because you don't need to be seeing me scrubbing the frying pan. Or get a And these weren't too bad on the uh, these two weren't too badly cluttered up, so they'll be fairly quick. I don't know if you can see this. There's a few bits that are actually still full of a little bit of carbon. I'm not going to worry about that. You can see the swirls where it was actually polished or ground. One here is the smarts. Probably somewhere from the 1930s to mid 60s. And this stuff should be melting off, which is quite nice. This one is actually steamed up, so I'm going to keep it as a personal user. favorite chef's fillet, but I screwed up the seasoning big time and I had to strip it down again. The nice thing about these leftovers is they lift up the seasoning very nicely. They've got a slightly pit for a couple of bottom. Stainless steel brush. I get the worst of it out. This is my personal user, so I'm not too worried. Now I've had this one stripped clean already. redo. So these are Levco Wear, if you can see that clearly written, made in Japan for the Canadian market. This one is slightly stained and it always has been. But these are awesome chef skillets. If you can find these, buy them. Especially if you can get them for cheap. Get 
put in a glove. I'm gonna shut down and get set over by the stove.